Then, to cut things away that you don't want, you want to first press S and put your marker like where you want it. So, as you guys can see right here, I'm going to cut away the things I don't like, which is just pressing S and delete. Hey guys, what's up? My name is Alex and awesome that you guys are watching Tuna's new Sony Vegas tutorial. It is Wednesday, it means a new video for you guys. And today I'm gonna show you guys, as you may see in another thumbnail, I'm gonna show you guys how to make uh, your footage look like a complete like Hollywood, like real actual movie, uh, just using some simple uh, pan and crop and some color correction. So I would say, let's get started. All right, so as you can see, we're on the Vegas screen, of course. So the first thing is you wanna do, you just wanna drag in the video file that you want to edit. I'm gonna do that right now. I found some like royalty free footage online um, so we're actually gonna edit that so as you can see just some regular stock footage some royalty free stuff and I'm gonna show you guys how to make this like scene look or like how to make any scene look like a complete like Hollywood movie just using some cropping and some some you know color correction so the first thing you want to do is, you know, all those movies have like those cinematic bars. Um, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm going to show you guys how to do that. So the first thing is, uh, you just want to click on this little icon which says Event Pan Crop. When you click that, this menu pops up and you want to make sure that at the left, those two icons are unchecked. The next thing you want to do is you just want to hold your mouse like on top of this. And you want to drag that down until you're happy with it. So as you can see at the right, I'll move it out of the way you will start to see that there will be appearing some black bars. So I'm gonna do that right now, as you can see. It is appearing, so I think this looks okay. Okay, so that's it for the uh, cinematic bars. As you can see, if I play it back, it looks pretty good already, but it's not gonna be, it, it needs like this like this final touch, and that is what, something we're gonna do with color correction. So now that we have the bars, um, you can actually choose how, like, how big they are, uh, basically, by just by dragging it, as you can see. I'm just gonna place it like this, close it out, and then you wanna go to color correction, over at the video effects tab and in the list you want to pick color corrector. You want to drag that on top of the video track and then this menu pops up and you don't want to mess around with all those uh, like those color mixers. You want to leave that. You just want to a, uh, pick a um, like preset that's already in Vegas for you. Just click on this little arrow that brings up this drop down menu and you want to pick red midtones. You're going to click that. It seems that it's like a legit Hollywood uh, movie so you can mess around with different color correction types. I'll play it back and you can just choose what kind of color correction you want to use. I think this one is a really good one um, but also like this one is a good one. Um, like this one, you know, this, you can choose from the drop down menu, as you can see, you have, you have a lot of options, but I would just choose a red midtones. That actually looks pretty good. So it actually looks better than, than the, the footage before. So let's, let's have a comparison. So let's drag that in. So this was what we had first, as you can see, boom, this one. And we went from this to this. And if you say like, okay, um, a lot of trees are out of the, out of the screen. Uh, you just go. You want to go go back to event pan crop. Keep this in the middle, and you just want to like drag that up or something like a little bit, so you want to see like more of the trees. That's what's similar to this, guys. So, so if you want to see more of the Sony Vegas tutorials every Wednesday at 12 p.m. PST, that's 9 p.m. CET. Uh, feel free to subscribe down below, and if you find this video helpful, you make sure to smash that like button. And as always, I want to thank you guys for watching. I hope this video was helpful to you. So I want to thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next Wednesday. So until then, I'll see you guys very soon. What's up guys, my name is Alex and welcome to a new Sony Vegas tutorial. In this video guys, I'm going to show you guys the basics of Sony Vegas, basics for beginners and how to get started. So I received, well first of all I make a lot of videos about specific things and I almost have like 90 videos up. So in this video I'm going to cover a few things in just one video except for you know how to render, how to import, how to edit, all the stuff. So I'm going to go through the basics and I will say let's jump straight into the video. Alright folks, so I am on Sony Vegas as always and basically I'm going to show you guys three simple things. So the first thing is I'm going to show you guys how to put your footage into Sony Vegas. Then I'm going to show you guys how to cut here and there and add some effects. And then I'm going to show you guys how to render um, it out. So in this video I'm going to show you guys how to make an entire video from you know, you know, except recording it But you know from recording it and I'm going to show you guys how to edit it and then you can you know render it and I have no idea why I'm doing like this So that is what I'm going to show you guys uh, those really three simple things um, So the first thing that you want to do is you want to import your footage from your SD card to your computer or if, or if you record on your computer You just want to you know get the file somewhere in like a nice folder so it's nice and organized Then you want to drag it in what I'm going to recommend is not dragging your 
um, like video into the timeline right here but I would say use this option which is going to you know we're gonna go to file import now you want to go to media let's say I'm going to import the intro of this video pick this one and I'm going to pick this one boom now the clip is imported and what the only thing you need to do again you know, well the only thing you need left you need to do is you want to drag this one onto your timeline boom so as you guys can see there we have the intro so this is the intro as you can see a lot of stuff going on with like with the sound waves so this is actually step one we did that we just put our, our footage into sony vegas so the right now the editing process will start so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to you know play back the file i'm going to edit this intro video um, like how I'm going to get it like in the, for the real video and then I'm going to show you guys how to render it and basically what, what, when it's done rendering you, the only thing you do is upload it so as you guys can see uh, we um, what I'm always doing it like guys I don't know how long this video is going to be but what I always do is when I look at the footage like this I always want to say like dude I want to spice it up so I'm going to go to the video effects tab like this and I'm going to add a little bit more brightness and contrast so as you guys can see at the you know on the list at, at the left i'm going to pick this one and track this on top of the video track and i'm going to pick my preset that's called audition because like months ago i had you know a series called audition adobe audition and i made a brightness and contrast preset for it but it's like a nice like a neutral general for me so i'm just going to pick this one uh, oh crap um, i'm going to pick this one rather audition boom so that, that looks a lot better as you can see i'll just show you guys like compare like you know from going from this to this as you can see so that looks way better so now that we have applied that one i'm going to um start editing the video we want to start at the beginning of our timeline and to play back the video and to preview everything you want to play, press spacebar what's up guys my name is alex and if you stop it that also space so spacebar what's up guys spacebar that's how you play and stop the video then to cut things away that you don't want, you want to press, press S and put your marker like where you want it. So, as you guys can see right here, I'm going to cut away the things I don't like, which is just pressing S and delete that, that part. So, I'm going to start off with the first one, uh, which is called the transition. I'm going to go to transitions and I'm going to pick a slide. And I'm going to pick like that it's going to slide in the screen like this. Boom. So I'm going to drag that on top of the beginning one, as you can see right there. Or for this video, I'm just going to drag it a little bit more. So as you guys can see, boom. What? We have a nice, you know, when it's like, like that is a nice appearance. What's up, guys? Boom. What's up? Looks really good. So this is your beginning, actually. Okay, so I'm going to drag it a little bit shorter. But it starts a bit earlier, like this. Boom. I'm just going to continue editing this actual in video so you guys can see how it's done. The basics of Sony Vegas, basics for beginners, and how to get started. So I receive, well, first of all, I make a lot of videos about specific things, and I almost have like 90 videos up. So in this video, I'm going to cover a few things in just one video, except for, you know, how to render, how to import, how to edit, all the stuff. So I'm going to go through the basics, and I would say, let's just, let's. Okay, as you guys can see, I messed up right here. Okay, let's just, let's, let's just, let's, so I'm going to cut that away. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut at the end of the sentence. Through the basics, the basics, like this. Through the basics, just press S and those are loose from each other. And then I'm going to cut to the next one that is the good one, this one maybe. And I would say let's jump straight into the video. So I'm going to pick that one. So I'm going to press on S. And now what you want to do is you just want to press your delete button, not backspace. And now you can put this one again. You can just, you know, put them together. And this, you know, bl blue lines appears to show you guys that it's together. And you can, just, you can just drag this one with holding your left mouse button. And now we have this. So I'm going to go through the basics. And I would say let's jump straight into the video. Boom. That is basically what it, what we have. So I'm going to cut this away. And you guys can see what we have right now is this. Go through the basics. And I would say let's jump straight into the video. So that looks pretty good already so as you guys saw it's really simple though okay and now you guys can um, edit the video so this was the editing part and let's say you're done editing and guys I'm just going to show you guys this example how to edit I'm not going to edit this entire video so just this is just the basics how you can do it so it's really simple I showed you guys how to add a transition to it and also background music if you guys want that so I'm gonna show you guys how to do it as well so I'm just going to drag in a song into the timeline that I like. And yes, you can you can drag it into the timeline because a song is less 
heavy or riskful that it's going to crash. So I'm just going to drag in a nice copyright free song. Okay, so I'm just going to put it underneath it as you can see right there. Boom, we have like we have the music and as you guys can probably hear What's up guys, my name is Alex and welcome to a new Sonic Vegas tutorial. In this video guys, I'm going to show you guys the it's basics way too of loud. Sonic. So the only thing you need to do is you will just want to go to stand on the on the very top of the of the track of the yellow line. You want to hold your mouse button and you want to drag this white line down. That's the volume until you're happy with it. So I'm going to try it. I'm just going to put it like I'm just I'm, not, I'm just going to let it play and then lower it how how it's supposed to be. So. Let's, let's see how it goes. What's up guys, my name is Alex and... Guys, I have literally no idea why the video, well, while OBS lags when I'm going to play back the video in Sooner Vegas, guys. I don't know, I mean, I probably it's going to be like a bug, so I'm going to try to fix it. Um, so, thank you for understanding. Yeah, I'm, that sounds good. Minus 26.1 decibels. So I'm going to cut press, also it works for audio, just press, as you can see this one track, just press S, and now they're just split, and now you can just, you know, remove them. So let's say you just have fin finished editing the entire video, not the only the intro. Um, I'm just going to show you guys how to render it. So always make sure, always, that you select what you're going to render, because let's say if you forgot something, like right on, on like right there, and let's say if you don't select it it's going to render another 40 minutes at adding to the video because you didn't select everything so let's say you are probably going to like let's see let's say like render like this when your video is like 40 seconds long um, you just also want to select it as you can see the blue zone that's why you want to render out because let's say if you forgot a part right here and and you didn't select it it's going to also render out that part and it's going to also render out this entire piece so you don't need that black so just make sure to do that make sure you render you render are not like not like another 10 minutes of black on your video so i'm just going to select everything that's what i always do so i can make sure i really have everything then i'm going to go to this little icon it's you know this one then i'm going to put this one not on 60 fps just on the regular 1080p um, which is this one. Boom. As you can see, 1080p, 30fps. I'm to click on apply and click on OK. Now the only thing you want to do is click on file, render as, and here you want to choose your format. I'm just going to pick the same, you know, render setting, this one. Then you want to go to browse and choose where you want to save this. I'm just going to save this on my desktop. I'm going to call this, let's say, nice intro. Boom. I'm to click on save and now the only thing you need to do is click on render and congratulations you have right now you have first made your first video that is basically how simple it is i mean you right now you just rendered out your first video i'm going to cancel this but as you guys can see you just finished out you finished you know you're making your video and when it's done I'll, you know just watch it again uh, for like mistakes and then what if, and if you checked it you can just upload it on youtube and those are the basics how to start you know making videos guys everything is gonna you know be, be really easy and um yeah that's the video guys so those are the basic things you need to know guys and now i hope you guys can get started with editing um so uh, i'll just show you guys three simple things and how to edit and basically i hope you guys can get started right now and if you have any questions make sure you know to you know ask them in the comments down below and i'll try to answer as many questions as, as i can of course uh, regarding Serena vegas so so i hope you guys enjoyed this little basic video make sure to smash the like button down below for more videos and also the subscribe button down below and i want to thank you guys for watching i hope to see you guys in about two hours from now for the last Sony Vegas tutorial of the day. And I will see you guys in two hours. Just Alex Halford.